If uh, we're uh, afraid uh, of the uh, rain, uh. then uh, we better move to another climate, right? Right, uh, right. Rain yeah. makes the grass green. That's what I always say. More in store this week? Uh, no, actually, you know what? Might get some tan on this white skin. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good analogy or not, but yeah, it's going to be 80 degrees tomorrow. So I hope you enjoy uh, the nice weather this week. Uh, it's going to be a mostly dry week too with temperatures, uh, like I say, above normal, which is something we haven't said in a long time. Uh, 44 degrees right now down in Seaside. Quiet morning out there and looking nice out there along the coast this morning. Just a few scattered showers. Ridgefield, A and A camera up there in Southwest Washington. Good morning, you folks there. 53 degrees out there. It looks like clear skies actually as we look off to the north and west above the casino there. And back here in downtown Portland, a few passing clouds right now. Some scattered showers to the south and east of Portland. Those should push off into the Cascades here in the next hour or two. So we'll just call it mostly cloudy skies right now. 56 degrees in the Rose City, relative humidity at 80%. And the winds are currently calm right now. Okay, current conditions, 40s and 50s along the coast. It's a cool morning out there at Astoria. Good morning to you folks there, 45. And we got 50s in the Valley, 58 in uh, the Dalles at the eastern end of the Columbia River Gorge, mostly in the 40s and 50s over there on the central and east side. Hey, bike forecast this morning. If you're gonna bike into work, morning ride, we'll call it upper 50s, just a chance of a shower, especially again, south and east side of the metro area. Rain chances just 20% across most of the area. Boy, that sunset tonight though, Right about nine o'clock. Okay, there's those scattered showers you see. They're pushing in off the coast from the southwest. Again, mostly on the south and east side of the metro area now in Multnomah and Clackamas County and in Marion County as well. Those will continue to dissipate and move off. I don't see much of an advancement of this to the north and west. So folks up there in Clark County and further off on the north and west parts of the metro area should remain fairly dry. As we widen out the satellite and radar, there are no systems off the coast. In fact, we got a ridge of high pressure moving in. This morning, that'll give way to some sunny skies tomorrow. We're going to go well above normal coming up. Okay, just one one hundredth of an inch in Portland since midnight. Light amounts across the area. Boy, we had a lot of rain yesterday, though. Those scattered showers were heavy at times. So we'll just call it just a chance of a shower today. Sunshine likely on the way Tuesday, probably around 80. In fact, I'm going for 80 on Tuesday tomorrow. And then we'll remain mostly dry the remainder of the week. There's those rainfall totals from yesterday. Nearly half an inch under a heavy shower in Vancouver. And uh, PDX about a third of an inch, same with Aurora and down in Salem. So it was a hit or miss uh, scattered showers yesterday across the region. Uh, normal high 72. We managed that yesterday, so we we're right at average for this time of the year. And we'll continue to ro raise those up coming up over the next few days. Hey, golf forecast, if you're getting in some tea times today, call it scattered showers possible in the afternoon. That's the uh, time that I would see those scattered showers, and they would just be light. Okay, seven-day forecast, we'll call it just a scattered shower chance day, 67. Warm tomorrow will go 80 with mostly sunny skies on Wednesday well, as well. But, boys, we look ahead to the weekend, guys, the rain chances coming back. All right, thanks, Steve.